Saturday evening at nine o'clock, the Ruth Rendell Christmas mystery. No crying he makes. George Baker stars as Detective Chief Inspector Wexford. And following that at 10.45, we visit Dame Edna's Hollywood with the lady herself, Barry Humphreys. The outstanding individual performance of the day, Ian Wright of Arsenal, four against Everton. Magnificent finishing by Manchester City's David White, Liverpool survive, but only just. Very good afternoon to you. Wet and windy in most places. Uh, amongst those affected, the first division leaders, Manchester United. The pools panel sitting for the second successive Saturday. Let's take a full pools check now uh, with all today's scores with Bob Colston. Thanks, Elton. Beginning with Barclays League, Division 1. Arsenal 4, Everton 2. Chelsea 4, Oldham 2. Liverpool 2, Manchester City 2. Manchester United against Aston Villa is a panel result. One point, home win. Norwich 0, Queen's Park Rangers 1. Sheffield Wednesday 2, Wimbledon 0. And West Ham 1, Sheffield United 1. Division 2, Blackburn against Derby County is a panel result. One and a half points, away win. Brighton 3, Millwall 4. Not on the pools, Bristol Rovers 3, Bristol City 2. Grimsby Leicester, panel result, 3 points for a score draw. Middlesbrough Oxford United, panel result, 1 point, home win. Port Vale 1, Wolves 1. And Sunderland 1, Portsmouth 0. Division 3, not on the pools, Birmingham 3, Fulham 1. Bolton Swansea is a panel result. Two points, no score draw. Bournemouth one, Stoke two. Chester Wigan, panel result, two points, no score draw. And Shrewsbury one, Berry one. Division four, Aldershot one, Burnley two. Barnet two, Mansfield nil. Blackpool one, Carlisle nil. Cardiff against Crewe, panel result, one point, home win. Chesterfield 1, Northampton 2. Gillingham 1, York 1. Halifax against Maidstone is a late result. Rotherham 1, Lincoln 1. And Scarborough against Hereford is a panel result, one point, home win. GM Vauxhall Conference, Barrow 0, Redbridge Forest 1. Cheltenham 1, Kidderminster 2. Colchester 3, Witten Albion 2. Kettering 3, Merthyr Tidville 1. Slough against Bath City is a late result. Stafford Rangers 1, Altrincham 2. Telford United 1, Gateshead 1. Wickham Wanderers 1, Rancorn 0. And Yeovil 2, Farnborough 2. Beza Homes League, Bashley 2, Dover 0. Cambridge City 1, Crawley 3. Dorchester 1, Gravesend 1. 1. And Fisher Athletic nil, Trowbridge 4. B&Q League, Scottish Premier Division. Dunfermline against Airdrie is a panel result. One and a half points, away win. Hibernian nil, Falkirk 1. Motherwell against Aberdeen, panel result. One point, home win. Rangers 2, Dundee United nil. St Johnston against Celtic, panel result. One and a half points, away win. And St Mirren nil, Hearts one. Scottish Division one, Dundee against Ayr, panel result, three points, score draw. Four for Clydebank, panel result, one point, home win. Kilmarnock against Montrose, panel result, one point, home win. Meadowbank Morton, panel result, one and a half points, away win. Partick Thistle nil, Wraith Rovers one, and Sterling Albion against Hamilton, panel result, one and a half points, away win. Scottish Division 2, Albion Rovers against Dumbarton, panel result, one and a half points, away win. Alibur Queen's Park, panel result, two points, no score draw. Berwick 1, Queen of the South 1. 
Break in East Stirling, panel result one point, home win. Clyde against Stenhouse Muir, panel result three points, score draw. Cowdenbeath against Arbroath, panel result one point, home win. And finally, another panel result, Stranra against East Fife, one point, home win. Thanks, Bob. Merry Christmas to you. Here are the score draws. Three, seven, ten, twelve, seventeen, twenty-three, twenty-five, thirty-one, thirty-three, thirty-five, thirty-eight, forty-six, fifty-four, and fifty-six, and only two no-score draws. 16 and 53. In fact, there is one more, uh, a game which was called off, number 14, Bolton. So three no-score draws. 16, 53 and 14, which is actually on there. Tomorrow morning's headlines will be nominated by Ian Wright. Four goals for Arsenal against Everton at Highbury. Gabriel Clark with the details. Arsenal 4, Everton 2, just what George Graham wanted for Christmas. Three points to kick off the holiday campaign, thanks to four goals from Ian Wright and an Everton defence a bit too full of the festive spirit. Not that Arsenal's back four didn't play their part in an amazing first half. Everton won up inside two minutes when Mo Johnston set up Robert Varshika. Inside 60 seconds, Wright knocked in Steve Bold's flick on. He got his second from close range after Anders Limpa sprung the offside trap. Only for Kevin Sheedy to cross for Johnston to make it 2-2. But Limpar tormented Everton all afternoon. He was again the supply line for Wright to get his hat-trick on 26 minutes. And another cross from the flying Swede. And another toe-poke finish from Wright clinched the points 18 minutes from time. Arsenal 4, Everton 2. Thanks very much indeed, Gabriel. Uh, of course, the league leaders, Manchester United, didn't play today. So Alex Ferguson, their manager, nipped down the M62 to Anfield to watch the game between Liverpool and Manchester City. It finished to all, reporting Clive Tilsley. This was an Anfield Christmas cracker. Liverpool in front inside the first ten minutes through Dean Saunders were behind inside the last ten minutes, but Steve Neckel rescued a point for them. It was David White with two goals in the opening ten minutes of the second half, both lifted beautifully over the head of Bruce Grobelaar, who gave Manchester City the advantage. But Nickel, feeding off a cutback from substitute Mike Marsh, got the equaliser in the 82nd minute. Manchester City have put the brakes on Liverpool's title charge. They almost stopped it completely in its tracks. 2-2 the final score. Thanks, Clive. Obviously terrible weather uh, on Merseyside. Well, elsewhere in the first division, Clive Allen scored twice as Chelsea beat Oldham 4-2 in a real thriller. Dennis Wise with a penalty and Paul Elliott were Chelsea's other scorers. Ian Marshall got uh, tw uh, scored twice for Oldham. That's nine for, for Big Ian this season. Two goals at the start of the second half by John Sheridan set up Sheffield Wednesday's win against Wimbledon at Hillsborough. His first was a penalty. And the Sheffield United had defender Brian Gale sent off at West Ham for descent midway through the second half. Half. Brian Dean put them ahead in the 84th minute, but Julian Dix equalised two minutes later for West Ham. Uh, that was from a penalty. And Dennis Bailey hit a last-minute goal for the second successive week, and it was enough to give QPR victory at Norwich. Let's have a look at the top and bottom of the first division. Uh, it's just worth pointing out as you take that in that uh, Crystal Palace and Spurs play tomorrow, and so do Nottingham Forest and Leeds. Have a look at the uh, second division. Blackburn also one of the casualties today. So it's uh, Blackburn, Cambridge, Middlesbrough, Derby actually were due at uh, Ewood today. Top of the third and top of the fourth. It goes Birmingham, Brentford, West Brom, Stoke and Huddersfield. And Burnley, Mansfield, Barnet, Blackpool and Scunthorpe uh, in Division 4. There is another score draw or no score draw? Score draw, number 24, Halifax. Well, that's all from us this afternoon. Hope you have a very Merry Christmas. We'll see you next week. Bye-bye.